Hello, Gemini. This is Starbright. I'm here today to do a daily and a, a weekly read on you guys. Because you guys are wonderful. I've been getting a lot of views from you guys. All the so support, the comments, and likes, and sharing. Thank you. I'm doing a daily and a weekly in one reading. Because <laughs> you guys have been wonderful. <laughs> Gemini. It's not going to resonate with everyone, so please do not get mad if it's not your story. This is going to be for the sun, the moon, rising, and Venus, and Jupiter. Spirit of the earth, water, fire, and the air. Show me the cards I need to see for Gemini, Gemini daily reading. Show me the cards I need to see for Gemini. One important message for Gemini for August the 10th, 2020 daily reading. One important message for Gemini. Hmm. <laughs> Some of you guys are dealing with a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, or a Libra. Tell me more about this spirit. This person wants to commit to you. This is someone who sees the sunshine with you. This person sees abundance with you. They see happiness with you. They want to speak the truth to you, and they're very passionate about you. This is someone you could have kids with. If this is someone you could be committed to, or this is someone of authority, or this could be a Taurus. This made it. This person made a decision to work on things with you, but there was things that was hidden. Tell me more about the high priestess. Tell me more, spirit. Tell me more. That person is feeling the repercussions of the action because they was hiding something from you. A marriage. They were hiding marriage from you. This is why they're feeling left out in the cold. Tell me more about this. Tell me more. Tell me more. This person is trying to make a decision. This is someone you could have been with a long period of time, and this is someone that see long-term commitment with you, not worried about money. This is this is someone who could have walked away from you. So they're trying to control their emotions. This is someone that's feeling betrayed. And they want to come in. They want to come in and help you. This person wants to take action. This person wants to talk to you. This is someone that's definitely stressed out. This is someone who could be very depressed about you. And they're trying to be patient. Some of you guys are dealing with a Libra. A Capricorn. Taurus. Virgo. Gemini. This person see you as someone could be very controlling. They say they see that you could be, you know, have a big ego. This is someone that wants to apologize to you. This person is feeling a sense of loss and they are hurt. Overall energy, they reading for Gemini's. Mm, someone want to send you a very important message, or you want to receive a very important message about money. <clears throat> this is someone that oh, see you as they wish fulfillment. This is someone you could have kids with. This person. This is someone from your past. This is someone that could have cut you out of their life. They want to tell you the truth. About someone that has uh, spent their time and money and energy with. This is someone who tried to manipulate them. Could be Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, or a Gemini to try to manipulate them. This is someone that took action. This is someone they uh, will fight for that relationship. This person had one foot in and one foot out. This is the person they made a decision about. This, they feel like this person was a missed opportunity. Or this person had enough of this person that they was fighting for. Because this person was hiding things for them. This person was lying to them. Come on. This person is feel burdened by this. By this deception. This is someone that they pour all the emotions out to. This person was well off. This person had met their financial goal. This is who they start something new with. That's the overall energy. Could be dealing with a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Aries, Leo, Sag, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus, Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius. This is your daily. Come on, cards. For your weekly. Gemini weekly. It's not going to resonate with everyone, so please do not get mad if it's not your story. This is your weekly Gemini. 
Spirit of the earth. Spirit of the earth. Water. Fire in there. I'm looking for messages for Gemini for August the 14th through the 21st. What important messages for Gemini? August the 14th through the 21st, 2020. What important messages for Gemini? You have a Capricorn or somebody's in this energy. Someone is thinking about you. They see you as someone who very grounded. They see you as uh, having, like, having nice things around you. Could be a Capricorn. Like I said, this is someone who's very obsessed with you. This is the one who could have ghost you. Tell me more about this. Tell me more. Tell me more. Tell me more, spirit. Tell me more. This person sees sunshine with you. They see happiness with you. They see abundance with you. This is someone that wants a reunion with you. Tell me more about this. Tell me more. Tell me more, spirit. Tell me more. Put Cancer Python Scorpio or Libra. But somebody's in this energy. First, I want a reunion with you. This is someone that could be in a uh, could be married, or this could be a father of someone's kid, or this is someone that could be in prison, or this could be a Taurus, or this is someone of authority. This is someone that's in and out your life. They want to pour all their emotions out to you. They feel like you're a missed opportunity. Tell me more about this spirit. Tell me more. This person want to come in. They want to come in. They want to help you pay a bill to take you out somewhere. They want to make sure you're okay. This is someone is coming in as a knight. This is someone who's working on being the king. This is someone that you had to end them with. Tell me more about this. Tell me more, spirit. Tell me more about this. Tell me more, spirit. But this person was very deceptive. Reason why you had to end them with this person because this person was very deceptive. Tell me more about this seven of swords. Tell me more. Tell me more. Tell me more. This is someone who is he's, who's well off. This person live at a distance. They're trying to make a decision about this person. That's why they're feeling left out in the cold. This is someone they had moved to come with waters with. This is someone the angel was pushing them to make this decision about this person. So you... This is the one you had to end with. They were very deceptive because of someone that were well off. They live at a distance from them. They had to make a decision. Now they're feeling left out and cold. This is someone they had moved to come to waters with. Tell me more about this. Tell me more, Spirit. Tell me more. Your person is feeling the repercussions of their actions. This is someone that you had an argument with. Or this is someone you had drama with. A fight with. This person want to take this new leap to faith with you. Could be a Libra. This is the one who want to balance things out with you. This this person is holding on to you. This is the one that see you as a soulmate. This person was trying to manipulate you. This is the one who pour all their emotions out to you. So they make a decision to work on things with you. Tell me more about this magician. Tell me more about this magician. This person is not sleeping at nighttime because they tried to manipulate you. Now they're trying to be patient. They're heartbroken about this. This is someone who's very passionate about you. This is someone who wants to bring the start with you. This, this is someone who lives at a distance from you. Or this is someone that you're in a cycle with. This person is feeling defeated. This is someone who let you go. Yep, this person walked away from you because they were uh, feeling defeated. Yep, this person is feeling burdened by this, by walking away from you. Could be a Leo or a Cancer feel burdened because they left for you and walked away from you. This is the one that could have cut you out of their life. Now they wanted to sweep you off your feet. That person watching you. They're watching every move that you made. They're watching your social media, going by your house, or questioning your friends about you. This is someone who was holding back. This is one who wasn't giving 100% to you. This is an ex that feeling sad about this. This person want to come in and speak the truth. Over our energy. Over our energy. This person want a forward movement. Or any of you guys who have some kind of business opportunity going on. You guys going to be very successful. This is a card of success. 
If you got a business, a business going on, you're gonna you're gonna have forward movement. You're gonna be successful. This person wanna move forward with you. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't gonna lie guys If y'all have a business opportunity going on You're gonna be very successful This is a card of success <laughs> So I'm just throwing it out there <laughs> This person wanna move forward with you They want victory with you <laughs> This is someone that wants to apologize to you This person could be in a third party This is someone you could have met at work the person see you as being very abundant. Or you could be uh, pregnant. This is the one that you had to end in with. This person want to fight for this relationship now. Now they want to rush in. Now they want to fight for this relationship. But this is someone who's hiding something from you. Tell me more about the high priestess. They was hiding a brand new start. That's why they had one foot in and one foot out. This is what they this is what they had made a decision to hide it from you. They want to hide yeah, they made a decision to hide this relationship from you. That's why they had one foot in and one foot out. This is someone they could have been with for a long period of time. Cancer Pisces Scorpio or a Gemini. This person don't know how you feel about them. Cause they see you as a dominant female, a dominant male. They really don't play. But you, this person, wish you fulfillment. This is the one that took a break from you. The bottom of the deck. This person see you as someone who met their financial goal in life. So you could be dealing with a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, and an Aries, Leo, Sag, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus, uh, Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius. If you like my readings, give me a thumbs up. And thank you guys for following my channel. Hit the like button. Until next time.